What is going on guys, Sterling with Handsome WP here. In this video, we're gonna run through how to customize your WooCommerce checkout button. So there's a couple things we need to do. Number one, we're gonna add a function to your functions.php. And number two, we're gonna add some CSS in order to customize the border radius and the, uh, the color of your button. So let's jump right into it. So here we are on the checkout page, guys. If we scroll down, we can take a look at this place order button. You can see it just is kind of a dark gray color and it says place order. There's not an easy way to update the uh, the checkout button. You can, with some themes, update your WooCommerce button styles. Um, and then you can also, you can't change the text. Um, this we're gonna have to use that function for. So let's start with updating our text. Now I'm going to use a snippets plugin. I would suggest you can put this function into your functions.php, but it's very easy to break your website uh, if you're editing things in your functions.php. So I would not suggest that. Let's come over to my advanced scripts plugin. This is the script plugin I'm gonna use. If you wanted to use a free option, which I would suggest, uh, just go to your ad plugins and then search up code snippets and then you'll see it's right here it's this one that has a little scissors this is a great plugin for managing snippets uh, and it's a good free option so here you can see i have a little php code here that we would add to our functions.php or in this case we're just going to add it as a php snippet that runs on our website and we are filtering out our WooCommerce button and we are going to add our new our own text here. So you can see that I just have it. So it says buy today. So you would just change whatever is in these uh, between these two quotations, what we're returning. And this is going to return this text to our button. So let's activate this guy. So here we are back on our checkout page. Let's scroll down and now you can see it says buy today. So that was applied to our button. Perfect. Now let's adjust our color and our uh, and our border radius i wanted to add a little tip guys if you're using firefox and we click in here and we click on more tools we can actually use an eyedropper to pick the color that we want to add so i'm just going to change the color to our green our bright green color so i'm going to select that color that copied that green to my clipboard so now i'm going to come back over to my advanced scripts and i'm going to actually take a look at this customized checkout button color now we are selecting our id of payment and our class of place order and our class of button. So if you have them in this order, this should select your checkout button. Now I'm going to paste in that color that I just copied. So we'll put our hex code in there. That's gonna give us our green. And then we can set whatever border radius we want. So we just have border radius and then I'm setting it at 100 pixels, which is gonna give us a nice rounded button. So let's activate this guy. So we'll click save and activate. We'll come back to our checkout page and we'll refresh. And then there you can see we have a nice green button that says buy today. So we were able to customize this checkout button just the way we wanted. Now, kind of the version two of this or the other method would be using our handsome checkout plugin, uh, which allows us not only to customize the checkout button, but to uh, pick a bunch of beautiful templates and do a whole bunch of other stuff that's really powerful. But let's head over to our handsome checkout. So we're gonna select one of our templates that we already have done or one of our checkout pages. So I'm gonna select the My Handsome Checkout page. And then here you can see we have uh, a few products on this page. We have the multi-product template selected. We have some of our uh, some of our other stuff in there. So we have our logo and some other information in there. But I'm going to concentrate on the button color. So we are actually going to update it to that same green. So let's uh, highlight and paste in our green color. So there you go. And then what we can do is we can actually click into this one paste in the same green color but we're going to add a gradient so we're going to go a little bit darker on the second color and now it's going to give us a nice gradient between those two green colors next we're going to scroll down to this section that says checkout button text and we can change this to say whatever we want i have it just saying i want my product and then we can also click on this little cog which is going to allow us to adjust the size the default color of the text the font actually of the of the uh, button as well with height and uh, and then any icons that we want to add to it as well so really easy to customize your checkout button to look however you want uh, even adding an icon and uh, and customizing the the width and height of your button and then we're going to click update so here we are on our handsome checkout you can see uh, if I zoom out this is kind of more what it would look like uh, my logo is a little big because I am zoomed in just so you guys can see but you can see if I click next step, here's my payment info and here's my payment button. It is the green color that I want. 
it says the text that I want and it has the icon that I selected. So really easy to customize your button and the text on Handsome Checkout. And we have testimonials and trust seals and everything else that comes along with, uh, with Handsome Checkout. So I have other videos running over all the, the functionality and features of Handsome Checkout. If you want to check those out, um, feel free. I'll have uh, links in the description to all of our plugins that we uh, that we've built and created. Um, but but yeah, so those are kind of the two options. The number one option would be uh, add the function and the CSS to your uh, to your theme so that your uh, your website can update that color on your default checkout page. And the other one would be install Handsome Checkout, and you can control and customize pretty much everything to do with your checkout page. So. Um, I hope this was helpful. My name is Sterling with Handsome WP. If you guys have any questions or comments, be sure to leave a comment on this video or you can come and reach out to us on our website. I'll have all the links to everything that I talked about in this video in the description below. And thank you guys once again so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.